Hi, what's up you guys? It's your girl Anne and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you three bags that I got from my favorite site, which is AliExpress. Ooh, I love AliExpress to my heart. The only thing that annoys me, of course, things take forever to get to you no matter where in the world you live. Literally weeks to months. But I got three luxury slash novelty handbags, crossbody bags that I have to show you guys. So if you want to see what I got, stay tuned. Alright, so if you guys watched my previous video where I did a review on a Louis Vuitton Neverfull replica bag slash dupe bag that I got on DHK, you already know that your girl has been somewhat dabbling and, you know, lusting over luxury handbags. I would never buy one because of the price tag, but, you know, a girl can look and browse. So there has been this bag that I have been eyeing and it's from Dolce & Gabbana and I literally didn't even know it was from Dolce & Gabbana. I've been eyeing the bag just straight off of AliExpress. I had version 1 that I'll put here before. Again, didn't know that it was like a dupe slash replica bag but I had to sell that bag when I was moving to the United States. So I went on the hunt to get a replacement. All right, so the original bag retails for 2,995 US dollars and I think it's like a limited edition bag and it's called the All I Need Is Love and Wi-Fi and isn't that the truth? So this is my AliExpress version of the bag that I got for $31.99 including shipping and it took around two weeks to get to me in the US. So here we go, let's have a look. So we have gold metal hardware right here with a little attached charm. All I need is love and Wi-Fi. Giving you guys a close-up of what the hardware is looking like. The only difference, as you can see here, the side of this bag does not have the jewels that are on the original Dolce & Gabbana, which I don't mind at all. So on both sides, you have that. And you have it right here as well and BAM look at the other side like a notebook from back in the day day back in like primary school elementary school days and I love that it's like handwritten it says Queen I just love statement bags you guys like I'm not a simple bitch I'm not I love when I wear things people are like oh my god that's so cute where'd you get that so anything that you see me show on my channel, you know already that it's ain't gonna be simple. So the inside is like a faux suede material. Really, really, really lovely. And it comes with a crossbody strap that I have yet to pull. So this, probably one of the more expensive crossbody bags I've ever bought, to be honest. I think I really did splurge and it, I'm justifying it as a birthday purchase, okay? So we're in August, my birthday is in October, so this is an early present for me. Okay, so for the next bag, I came across this particular one while watching another girl's luxury slash novelty handbag haul. I'll try to link her video right here so you can go check it out. She was showing like some really weird bags, but this particular one, I was like, oh my god, I have to have it. And it's shaped like a house, yes. It's shaped like a house and I got it for $16.50 and came to $22 when you add shipping. Birthday gift number two. Yo. Yep. Yo. Like I'm getting so excited. I have nowhere to go but I'm buying bags, okay? I'm preparing for when we can actually go out. So let me give you the 360. And this particular bag comes in different colors as well. You can get it in a black, like here, or you can get it on pink on pink, right here, okay? Same price. So I chose this one, and the inside looks like this. Really, really spacious. It doesn't have any inside compartments, however, but that doesn't bother me at all. Gold hardware and it doesn't feel cheap at all. The only thing that I'm a little worried about is getting the white parts dirty. Um, so fingers crossed that doesn't happen because that's really gonna pet peeve me. But isn't she cute? Like, like the video if you think she's cute. Please press the 
like button right now if you agree okay so to finish off my little haul I went ahead and I got two cheaper bags these bags are like for nine dollars each including shipping now mind you I did warn you guys that they're a little bit cheaper in quality I'll be leaving links to all of these in the description bar by the way for you to go directly and buy away if you want but yeah so this one is a marble and I really love marble in any shade really but literally when I pulled the package I was a little bit disappointed because this, this thing is light as a feather but really cute if you want to take pictures but definitely it's not anything that's gonna be lasting you a long time the hardware on it is really cheap like this is thinner metal I um, wouldn't be surprised if it were to actually break if you were to put anything heavy in it so don't do that but still really 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 cute in terms of just dressing up an outfit as you can see right here as well this thing is so crooked it's it's just cheap I'm, I'm convinced this is probably just plastic coated with metal paint and the strap is also really stiff but nothing that you can't fix yourself if you have other bags you can just switch out the straps which i will probably do and just add a gold sleek strap on there girl nobody is gonna even know probably i will make it even look more expensive so this is the inside nothing too special just a little compartment to put your stuff and the bag did come as well with a little script right here I didn't bother to file a claim or anything which I would normally do once I realize anything comes wrong with my items I just like you know called it a day all right so this is the next bag also around eight or nine dollars including shipping I just really wanted a yellow bag um, so it's this one and it's like a graffiti type print really love it the only thing I hate about it is the strap I don't know why they put this god awful canvas red and black strap on it but again I will be switching it out for a gold strap from one of my other bags I also do not like that I don't have a top handle because your girl really likes like top handles to push her hand through you know look look all you know yeah so that's not there but I'll live really really lightweight and literally flatten out like that the inside does have a pocket right here for you to open and store items the zipper is fairly cheap but yeah again these items are perfect for just taking Instagram photos or if you're just gonna go out with your girlfriends real quick it's not anything that's like high high end be warned okay so those two last bags are awful work quality but if you like them as I said the links will be in the description bar below so if you like the video hit the like button please and thanks before you go hit the like button and show me some love subscribe to my channel please please and thank you before you leave share the video with all your friends and I'll be back 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 pretty soon with another haul until next time bye